Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So we've got a quick video for you guys. We're gonna talk about Microsoft Office, specifically on Apple Silicon Mac computers. So we're just gonna briefly run through how Office works on these computers, whether it runs well, what's compatible, and that type of thing. Before we get into that, if you're interested in your own copy of Microsoft Office for Mac or PC at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so in front of me, I have my new editing computer. This is a MacBook Pro with the M2 processor, and I've got the second option as far as the processor goes. So this one has a 12 core CPU, a 19 core GPU, and 16 gigabytes of unified memory. So to set your expectations, Microsoft Office runs great on Apple Silicon. In fact, it's gonna run better than on many PCs. I use Office almost every day on this computer and I'm super happy with it. Now, with that being said, there is one thing to bear in mind. The Mac version of Office isn't exactly the same as the PC version. For example, Outlook has a recent redesign for Mac and while it's great and easy to use, it's missing a large host of features that you'll usually find on the Outlook version for PC. So you kind of have to wait for Microsoft to release new features onto the Mac versions of the software. Excel is another example here. It's a little bit different than the PC version. Uh, most of the features are still gonna be available on Mac. It's just a little bit different. You've got different keybinds, different locations of things, and that type of thing. Uh, one thing that does work great on Mac is OneDrive. So you can install OneDrive to your Mac and it shows up as a folder in your Finder. So I've got mine on here and I'm able to click auto save on all of my Microsoft Office applications. So anytime I'm going in there, making a new document, making an edit, anything like that, it's all in the cloud and it's all gonna be saved for future use. Now, as far as compatibility, uh, it's, it's gonna be compatible with both M1 and M2. If you do a lot of tasks with a lot of applications, you might wanna have an M1 with more memory over an M2, but we won't dive too much into that in this video. Now, there is one important thing to note here. You might have a compatibility issue with the home and student version of Office on Mac. Uh, we've heard some people saying this, although I haven't personally tried it. <clears throat> we know for sure that Office Home and Business 2021 works on these M2 and M1 Mac, as well as Microsoft 365. Uh, but if you're wanting the one-time purchase so you don't have to pay a monthly subscription, Microsoft Office Home and Business 2021 for Mac will run pretty much flawlessly on these machines. And we have that available at our shop, so hit those links in the description if you wanna check that out. Now, if we take a look at specific applications, all of the applications are optimized for the Apple Silicon processors, except for Microsoft Teams. Microsoft Teams still uses x86 version officially, but Microsoft has an Apple Silicon alpha build which runs well on these computers. All right, so that's gonna do it for today's video. Hopefully we could clear up some questions that you guys might have as it relates to the Apple Silicon computers and running Microsoft Office. If you have additional questions or you need help installing, drop a comment down below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Again, if you're interested in Microsoft Office for Mac or for PC or other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll have links in the description box below. And if you enjoyed the video, we'd really appreciate a like, comment, subscribe, and share. So thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video.